What's up, y'all? This your girl, Go Mouth, coming at you guys with great, great news. Let me tell you. Last night, somebody um, commented on one of my Instagram posts, like when I did my cancer update video and I posted, you know, whatever. Anyways, I'm excited, y'all, because she got her lungs. Like, I'm so freaking excited for her. I'm so happy. Her name is Sha Will Win. I don't know if you pronounce it Sha or Shay. Either way, y'all, I've been watching her YouTube videos um, ever since I found out about Asha Sharon. Um, she, I've been following this particular lady because I found her through Asher's videos and she makes posts and they have the same um, uh, thing. They had the same thing. I think it's called pulmonary fibrosis or something with their lungs and they both have lupus. Well, had lupus. Rest in peace, Asha. Um, she, unfortunately, she passed away. You guys know I did a couple videos on her before and um, unfortunately she lost her battle with lupus and also pulmonary fibrosis i think i'm saying that name correctly y'all excuse me if i'm not somebody correct me if i'm saying it wrong but either way y'all she got her lungs um sha, sha will win she got her lungs um yesterday and she is currently in surgery right now she said it's gonna take about 12 hours surgery and y'all we just gotta stick together as sisters white black brown whatever um just as females in general battling different diseases um and like in my case cervical cancer in her case she has lupus and also pulmonary fibrosis um, anybody with any ailments y'all or even if you don't have any ailments us as sisters need to stick together and help each other uplift each other and um in our battles even in our day-to-day -day lives in just regular single moms married moms divorced moms whatever anything any all of us need to stick together and keep each other uplifted um and in a special prayer we need to send a special prayer today for um this young lady i will leave her youtube link in the description box below also i will link it in my comment section um i am so happy for her i hope everything goes well in her surgery she is she was in need of a double lung transplant and she was awaiting to her lungs she was waiting for the call to get her lungs and she posted a video yesterday that said she got the call and i just saw it i'm like wow i'm so excited for her um i really i really just um i forgot what i was going to say y'all but yeah i'm really excited for her and uh i really just hope everything goes well with the surgery and I've been rooting for her. I, I watch I watch a lot of her videos and um I never leave a comment because I'd be looking and I'm like, okay, 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 because I'm so used to to Ash's videos and I'm watching hers and it's kinda like I'm watching the same thing over again and I'm like, God, please don't let this happen twice. <laughs> please let this young lady get her lungs because I'm so sensitive, y'all. I can't deal with a lot of a lot of stuff, you know. Um, especially when, when people pass away and I that I've been rooting for because lord knows i miss asha's videos so much is it asha asha i miss her videos so much um because i used to i used to wake up literally and go searching for her channel like to see if she's okay did she post a video today is she all right is she okay and y'all now it's like okay now i'm looking for somebody to actually watch it i think that i connect with you know that i can connect with that i'm gonna go searching for that i'm rooting for somebody like that i feel like i lost that connection with some flipping through somebody's videos and hoping that they post you know because now i feel like okay i know a lot i do watch a lot of youtube videos but now i i was feeling like um i don't know i was feeling a little lost when when um asha passed because i would literally wake up looking for her videos now i'm i'm like okay i need somebody to fill in this void that i'm feeling for her because i i would always wake up to watch her videos now i'm like who who i'm gonna watch now who am i gonna watch now that excited me like she did and got me all hyped up like she did and um in the midst of me finding somebody to watch um i found um this other young lady who's dealing with the same um problem as um uh, that asha had and you know you know i kind of 
start liking her videos as well. Um, and I watch, I watch them a lot. I don't, I'm not stuck to them like glue like I was like with Asha Sharon, but, um, I still do watch and I still do root for her every day. And I was so, so excited when, um, somebody, um, posted on my Instagram page that she got her lungs. I went searching for her video. So she posted it yesterday and, uh, I didn't get to see it, but I'm still so happy. y'all. I'm so happy. You know, um, these, these different sicknesses that, that us women are battling is, it's, it's, I can't, I don't even know how to explain it, but a lot of us need somebody in our corner. It's hard if you don't got somebody in your corner rooting for you, whether it be the internet, somebody at your house, somebody down the street, somebody across the street, it don't matter. Internet, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, if somebody is, somebody going to be there regardless. They don't have to physically be there like me. I can be there, but not physically be there for somebody. As long as I, I know I show them love and I appreciate them just by watching the videos and saying positive stuff, keeping people uplifted, y'all. We all work together in this, y'all. We all work together, women and men included. I don't want to like not include the men in this because I know I have a lot of male followers that root for me as well, um, whether they comment or not, you know, um, but I was just saying in particular women that's battling different sicknesses, <sighs> y'all, it's hard, so I know how it feels to um, want somebody to be happy for you, want somebody to be there for you, want somebody to just say, you look good today, or somebody to just say, oh, you, you, great job or anything anything y'all y'all listen i'm so excited i feel like i got me some lungs y'all for real i feel like i got me some lungs you know i feel so happy and i really 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 pray to god that these lungs do her justice and she's able to breathe like she was breathing before she even had this problem and in that everything goes well in this surgery y'all she is currently on the surgery right now by the time i post this video she may be out i'm not sure because this was post this was told to me last night when i was sleeping so hopefully hopefully by the time this video is up she's up and she's breathing but i know she's probably she probably won't be able to post i don't know hey it might be a miracle she might just get up and start breathing and be able to walk out tomorrow you know <laughs> you know y'all i just i just wish her the best i wish her the very best um listen you got my best wishes i salute you for being this strong to even post videos at your weakest moments because I was not able to post a lot of videos when I was um, at my weakest um, doing chemo and radiation. I was not able to post. So um, I take my hats off to you for even having the courage to post your videos of your daily struggles and waiting on these lungs. Yeah, I know this is hard. I know this is hard because I've been through a lot. I haven't been through any problems with my lungs, but I've been through problems with other things. And dealing with cancer is not easy at all it affects you these sicknesses affect you more than physically they affect you mentally as well um right now i'm having a a, a pretty decent time it's early in the morning here so i um my day is just starting so i'm doing good so far so good um in the process of making bonnets y'all if y'all see this bonnet right here this is my emoji bonnet if anybody interested in this bonnet go check the link on my website um i have a few of these kind of bonnets left and um I'm just saying, just so you know, um, I made this bonnet myself. For all the new people who don't know, yes, I do have a website. I make bonnets to go um, for my medical bills um, and with my cancer journey. Um, if you new people don't know, I am a cervical cancer patient. I am right now cancer free and I will continue to be cancer free, but I keep having to go through and get checked. So that's why I started making bonnets to help me with my medical um, bills and costs and all of that stuff. Anyways, y'all, I ain't come here for me. I came here for Shawa Win. Go subscribe to her channel, like for real, and follow her journey. Um, you won't be disappointed. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. And that's all I got to say in this video. And I will holla at y'all later. Bye.